Are you watching the news right now? Yes, as well. Yeah. And another shutdown. Stay home and make sure to wear your aluminum hats before heading out. Aliens. Oh my god, what about my trip to Miami with the guy on Tinder that I met at the love of my life? What about my trip to DR? I'm never gonna get my body done! Yeah. Oh my god, it's so santissimo, please. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, my god. oh so now y'all need me. Yes! yes. Man, you really. D, so sorry to disturb, mm. but I've been talking to this new girl and I kind of made a huge mistake and sent some pictures that were a little misleading. You know that's catfishing, right? I know. I've just been talking to her for a long time and she's starting to say some things that I actually kind of like and I kind of feel like I'm ready to meet her. Okay, well, if you see a future with her, stop capping and tell the truth. Honestly, you're talking like a poet right now. That's some good advice. Listen, we in California. Take her for a long walk on the beach. Tell her you want to meet her parents or something. I don't know, something cute. But leave me alone because I'm very busy right now, okay? Oh my God. She says she's down to meet me tonight. Yo, dude, this is some of the best advice I've ever gotten. Yo, tonight, I'm gonna tell her everything. I'm gonna let her know all the truth. That was quick. That's good, though. Like, go go do what you gotta do, because I got shit to do, okay? Got you. Bye. Hey, what's up, D? Oh, what's good, historically accurate Jesus? Oh, you know, just answering prayers, cleaning feet. What you reading? Just checking my horoscope. And why? I need to know if I'm in the right path in life, you know? You could just have more faith. I mean, faith is cool and all, but I need to know what's happening in my life today, okay? You believe everything that the app tells you? If I try hard enough. <laughs> you could just pray harder. To be honest, I don't think you and I should be speaking every day. Libras and Capricorns ain't even compatible. So you're ending this? No, I'm not ending this. I'm gonna see you for Christmas. You mean my birthday? Mm -hmm. Yo, D, listen. I met this dude on my Instagram, you know, the one that I used to stalk people. Well, anyway, I met this dude and I'm kind of falling for him and now he's texting me and I don't know what to say. I mean, that's messed up, but sounds better than what I'm doing. You know what you should tell him? Tell him that you want him to suck your mm. And after that time that you want him to clap that Damn, you nasty. They don't call me D nasty for no reason. <laughs> oh, he said, baby girl, I'm hungry and I'm about to feed you with the truth. You see why I like him? Damn, this is so good. What else? Tell him that you want some potatoes and jam it right up your Uncle, yeah. Ooh. I've done that before. That's called the mashed potato. Yeah, yeah. Man, this is a lot of fun in a very toxic way. Look at Tell him that you want to meet him after work. Well, I already did. He says he lives around the area, but I'm gonna have to come clean because I'm not a six foot five Australian woman. Anyways, I'll tell you how it goes. Yo, Ryan, you mad loud, bro. I didn't want to say anything, but chill D loud. Ooh, Sasha, I am nervous. I'm about to meet a new girl right now for the first time. Yo, I am so stressed out. I have to break it down to this guy that I've been catfishing that I'm not Australian. That's crazy. I'm about to meet a real Australian right now. A six foot five one. Uh, you don't happen to be Papi Tulo 65, huh? How do you know? Kangaroo pouch 420? You catfish me, Sasha! Yo, How does it look like you're a vegetable? I have a 